Alright, so you might be asking yourself, what is nursing informatics? Well, uh, before we start, my name is Genesis Santos. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'd much rather show you what, uh, what, uh, what nursing informatics is rather than explaining what nursing informatics is, if that makes sense. A lot of what we do in the medical field revolves around data. Uh, for the most part, a lot of these newer systems like Epic, Cerner, there's thrives off of data. You guys know that. Everything that we do, we chart. Anything and everything that we do or put into a system like Epic or Cerner comes back as data. So the information that I'm actually showing you through this video is basically data. And anything and everything that you're taking in is data. And what you do with it it's kind of like it's, it's kind of like cataloging it in the back of your mind as to what what, what you want to do with information so it's similar to nursing informatics everything that you're kind of taking in is, is still information right but how you catalog it is really up to you i'm gonna head to work and then uh, i'll kind of show you the process of like how nursing informatics works but i mean I, I technically don't do that stuff yet but what on the nursing side of it how how it will affect a nursing informatics specialist, you know, and what they do with information, so. So I just finished my assessments and also my chart. Anything and everything that you put into a database or a system basically becomes data, pertinent data for us to actually track in informatics only because when it comes down to it we need that information for let's say for example the ACA we need certain criteria or certain numbers for us to meet so we get reimbursement for the ACA hope that makes sense so everything that I'm charting everything that goes into the systems is basically information and data and you see the specialist's job or the informatic specialist is their job to basically utilize that information to help workflow what do i mean by workflow basically a workflow making the nurse's job and also information to the patient a lot easier than what it really is because if your job entails you having a hard time putting in these informations especially into epic makes the job a lot harder. You're working a lot with the information technology department to basically make the workflow better for the nurse, making information to the patient a lot easier than, you know, easier than what it should be because sometimes information is difficult to to understand or it's hard to get. So that's that's what the job entails. Now, the reason why I'm doing this video is because if you're like me, back in 2005 I wanted to do something with computers and I'm very proficient with computers, period, and information systems, and I'd love to learn more about it. And, that, you know, to me, that's, that's very important to do something that you like. And the biggest takeaway from this video should be the fact that uh, nursing informatics has to do a lot with data, informations. And if that's not up your alley, then maybe something that you'd want to do. Just grabbing a warm blanket, by the way. So there is one more thing I want to point out before I go and this is kind of give you guys an idea of how big this field is going to become and I hope you understand that um, I'm getting my reference from um, Young's book called Healthcare USA. I'm going to show you guys really quick and uh, sometimes you have to be visual for you to see. So right now our the United States USA present okay present we are in a 1.9 billion dollar deficit, okay, 1.9 billion. It is projected by the year 2025 that this 1.9 billion is going to double. So we're looking at a 3 billion dollar deficit. So what does this mean? So currently with the United States, we lack, um, I don't know the exact numbers, we lack millions of um, healthcare jobs all across the board, anywhere from CNA, RNNP, CRNA, and you name it, even doctors. And the trend of medical doctors basically uh, being female is becoming a norm. And 
we are lacking primarily in primary health, uh, psych, um, even specialties, just basically all across the board. And the reason why I wanted to show you this is because if this is going to double by the year 2025, that means even for informatics itself, okay, informatics itself is going to double the demand and apparently even in my own institution right now they've opened up I think it was about four positionings in regards to the informatics system and they're even looking for more people to start working with it all this data the heap of data that you're receiving from the bedside and now you're going to bring it over to the IT portion let me ask you who's going to manage the IT portion in regards to even understanding the nursing informatics side or the nursing bedside and transform it into information that's where the nurse informatics specialist comes into play and uh, this is why I believe by the year 2025 this job specifically is going to be bigger than we think so yeah and that there ladies and gentlemen is basically nursing informatics in a nutshell it's taking data and uh, basically putting it through a systems and utilizing that information to transform healthcare into bigger better things and I hope you understood this video because basically all the data that I just fed you it's it's information for you to uh, for you to store and for you to utilize so yeah i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did don't forget to smash the thumbs up button if you guys want to see more of the nursing informatics side as i progress through this uh through this journey of mine with uh masters let me know i uh, hope you guys are doing great don't forget to check out these other videos i have to offer i'll take care Shh.